Ken Saro Wiwa is the charismatic leader of the Ogoni people in Nigeria, whose land has been polluted by Shell. His international campaign to save the Ogoni environment has put him on a collision course with Nigeria's military rulers, who derive most of their wealth from oil. We are going to demand our rights peacefully, non-violently, and we shall win. Shell produces 50% of the oil which sustains the military regime, so they are seen as being in league with the government. This dependency on oil means that a campaign like the Agonis could spark off a domino effect and so threaten the dictatorship's survival. Occasions when uh, villagers have protested against the activities of Shell, the Nigeria police have been called in very swiftly and sometimes with fatal results to the protesting villagers. The rape, young girls, beat the fathers, they shoot some people, they frighten people, they shoot anyone on sight, they target you as if they are learning how to shoot. <laughs> They can arrest as much as 200 people. When they get to the administration, they have to torture them and they have to pay some money before they are released. Most people receive about 50 to 60 strokes of a cane every morning, afternoon and evening, every day. Saruwiwa languishes in prison, and Ogoni land is a military zone, closed to the outside world. Uh, they drive all over Ogoni in the army jeeps, killing people. Available now on Video On Demand.